gay couple have flogged more than 80 times for having sex before a woman is caned for selling alcohol in Indonesia's Sharia law province. As crowd chats hit them harder. It kind of sounds like a good Saturday night if you're on the same city as I am, but regardless. So, a gay couple have been publicly flogged in Indonesia's Akan province after a local Islamic court found them guilty of having sexual intercourse. Uh, huh? Okay. Uh, the pair were whipped more than 80 times each in front of a thousand strong jeering crowd after having been apprehended by a homophobic Vidalanchi mob earlier this year. They were among 15 people whipped outside a mosque in the fundamentalist Muslim province capital Ba'akau on Friday, which also saw a young woman caned for selling alcohol. It, this is the religion of peace, everybody. Remember that. Uh, both the young woman and the gay couple were led to the, perform, to the platform dressed in white, while a masked executioner ran down lashes from a rattan cane on their backs. The crowd, which include tourists from the neighbourhood Malaysia, Malaysian snapped pictures and shouted, flog them harder as they were beaten. The unidentified men were... Sorry. The unidentified men were the second gay couple whipped in public this year in Aachen, underscoring the increased discrimination faced by the Indonesian small LGBT community. I wonder why the community is so small. I, I, I have no idea. It, it, it's, it's weird, that, isn't it? But let's keep going. The men have been apprehended by vigilante mobs at a, Bahat, a beauty salon early this year and handed over to police, authorities said. The men were reportedly found guilty of homosexual intercourse after the court established that they were in a relationship. Gay sex is not illegal elsewhere in Indonesia, but there has been a backlash against the community in recent years. Akan is the only religion in Indonesia, the world's most populous Muslim majority country that is imposes in Islamic law. Public flogging is a common punishment for a range of offences, including gambling, drinking alcohol, and having gay sex or relations outside of marriage. God damn, I would be flogged so hard if I was over there. Hopefully the flogging were not for the gay sex, by the way. Just saying. So hang I was on. about to say. Yeah. Don't lie. <laughs> Did they the actually... Hell? So hang on. If you're in a relationship with a woman and you yeah. have sex with her, do you get flogged as well? I don't know. That's okay under Islam, isn't it? To have well, sex with your Well, it says here. Person. It says, public flogging is common punishment for a range of offences, including gambling, which, <laughs> who doesn't like a good gamble, drinking alcohol, <laughs> god damn it, I would be so drunk, and having gay <laughs> sex or relations outside of marriage. Ah, uh, yes, and of course. Indonesia must right. not have too many high-rise like rise buildings. <laughs> so, yeah. gay no, sex but, um... or relations outside of marriage. Yeah, so if you have sex outside of marriage, a man and a woman, they would both be stoned. So this and is why I don't go to Indonesia. And it's also far worse mm. um, if you're married. Uh, that means you, you get stoned for um, adultery. outside of marriage mm. and adultery, which I believe is death. Pretty sure that's death. Yeah. I don't know. I... And another thing too mm. is you're most likely talking about Sharia courts in this article. Yes, yes we are. Yes, I hate those things. Yeah. Yes, me too. Considering the fact that I would be stoned for buying alcohol, gambling, and having sex outside a relationship. That yeah, 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 yeah. I'd be dead if I lived in Indonesia in that yeah. situation. I'm guessing there's not a real big Tinder market over there. Just saying. <laughs> but I'm anyway. probably the only one who doesn't get stoned because I don't gamble, I don't drink, and I've never had um, sex outside of my relationship. So there, guys, you heard it first. Uh, satellite can live in Indonesia and not worry about being stoned. Um, Apparently. Yeah. yeah. 
Well, there you go. I, well, I, I, hate, I hate the locals, but they won't hate me. How about that? That's true. <laughs> Let, let's keep jumping on if there's any way to we'll get through this. Hopefully the <laughs> floggings were witnessed today were several of a as a lesson for people not to violate Sharia Islamic law, said Bala al official Hasmani Tanhani. I am done we're gonna try and pronounce that. Few in the crowd appear to have much sympathy. I don't think they're being serious about the flogging. It looks like they're just playing around, said Barra, a fisherman who came to watch with his wife. Well, take the kids up to a good day flogging, yeah! The Sharia <laughs> officers shout and flogged them as hard as they could. Asin on the northern tips of Shamanta Island said a year would be stop public whippings and in a fu- future carry out such punishment behind prison walls. Oh, so then they're not going to stop publicly. Sorry, they're not going to stop being people. They're just going to stop doing it publicly. Oh, well, that's so much better then, isn't it? However, the new policy <laughs> has not been implemented. What were you going to say, Slabs? Keyword, not publicly. I wonder yeah. what they're going to come up with once it's like behind closed doors. Yeah, well, funny enough, is uh, over in the detention centre in Australia... There were a lot of condoms sold to the all-male population. Um, and that makes sense. Yeah. I mean, it does make sense, but also, what the fuck? So the people that will literally stone you for being gay were engaging in sex, same-sex marriage? Uh, yeah, it sure so sounds that way. Say, I think you mean to say, what are they fucking? <laughs> well, apparently it was each other <laughs> in an all male prison. But let's keep going yeah, because no, otherwise just, YouTube is going to flag yeah, this video think... in oblivion. Oh, yeah. I was going to say, they're probably just using the condoms for masturbation, that's all. Really? <laughs> nah, I don't think yeah. so. But anyway, um, Erwin Desmond, Desmond, I might be mispronouncing, head of the Barra Aka Prosecutor's Office said it had not received any paperwork ordering public caning and stopped and called for the issue to be re-examined. Well, uh, how do you plan to remove the cane marks from the people's backs? I I have no idea, but let's get going. There are pros and cons in... Topical cream. Yeah, yeah, it's the magic. It's just going to disappear. You know, they're going to take it back now. There are pros and cons for this society, so we suggest we sit the governor again to discuss this. He told reporters, adding that the caning would be continued to be held in a public for now. Anyway, okay. Um, uh, so, uh, two gay guys and a woman were publicly flogged in Indonesia while she was flogged for selling alcohol and they were flogged for being gay. Um, this is the religion of peace that we keep hearing about, is it? I, 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 I've said to have a different definition. Quote, unquote, religion of peace. Yeah, it's, uh, it's funny how all these leftists seem to, uh, want to bring Sharia laws and, uh, and the, uh, Muslim religion into these, uh, Western countries and makes you wonder how they're going to handle a whole bunch of trannies and, uh, leftists. Makes you wonder, doesn't it? Well... They're probably going to have to bring in truckloads of rocks and just put them around the city centres because they're going to need them. Yeah, well, all jokes aside, it does make you wonder <laughs> what is actually going to happen when the left realise, oh shit, this religion isn't actually as tolerant as we were led to believe. Nothing is ever what it seems. Mm. Do you think a few leftists <sighs> might uh, change their tune after they start going through and witnessing the first few canings or... Maybe the left uh, is brainwashed quite easily by Takiya. True, true. Yeah. What do you reckon, Slaps? Do you reckon the uh, you reckon the left might uh, reconsider Islam as a possible solution to religion when they? Uh... Until it gets here, I'm gonna say no. They can't be that silly, can they? Really? They. Like... Yeah. Yes, they. I live in the U.S. People mm. are that retarded here. It's embarrassing. <laughs> like I'm embarrassed to be a U.S. citizen, not because I believe in, like, just the American dream. It's like the left are so fucking retarded. It just embarrasses me. Mm. Yeah. To be a part yeah. of this. They're that bad here in Australia too. Yeah, yeah, they are pretty bad actually. It, it does. Yeah. <sighs> 
look at the end of the day, I, I don't see I don't want to see anybody stoned. I don't want to see anybody caned. Yeah, sure as hell don't want anybody caned for selling alcohol or being gay. I, I think being caned for being gay is a little ridiculous, regardless of your views of being gay or not. Um Exactly. So at the end of the day, it's just but you know that this is the left that you know they're going about tolerance and L B G T P plus Q M I Z B V. Hey, you know the people that are in our Discord, like they they all have their very like extreme views. I don't give a shit one way or another. No, like, do what you want. Like to see this situation of the left bringing in Islam, it doesn't make sense to me. Hmm. Well, not a well, single bit. Well, Muslims are going to be throwing stones inside of the left's um, glass house, and they're going to shatter it down. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, but unfortunately, the rest of us are also going to copy or cop the 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 fallout from this as well. That's the problem. Yeah, that, if if this yeah, if, if this was just simply a leftist, if this was a country, say like Sweden, for example. Say Sweden was run completely, everybody in there was progressive. Everybody. There was not one single centrist, libertarian, republican, right, alt-right. Just everybody was progressive. I wouldn't give two shits if Sharia law or, or Muslims or whatever went over and made that the, their third state, whatever it is. I, I wouldn't give it two shits. I'd be like, you brought this on yourself. Have fun. The result would still be the same. Well, yeah. yeah. Sweden would be literally being sodomized right now. Yeah, well, yeah, they can't even have a music concert with because they're worried the girls are going to be raped. But that's what I say. That the problem is, is that I my problem with it is that you're not only screwing over yourselves as a progressive, but you're screwing over everybody who's fighting against bringing this in. And that's where I have a problem. You know, if you if you want to go through and advocate for bringing in Sharia law and all that, and you're and everybody in your town is progressive, then I wouldn't give two shits. But it's the the danger of the innocent people getting hurt from it that bugs me the more than anything. But um. yeah, it was like I was saying, like people in our Discord, like Bomb and McCoy, like mm. they have very like hard stances on their beliefs yeah i don't give a single fuck like do what you want i'm not gonna affect you i'm not gonna try to affect you but like just be civil just be civil don't fucking kill people don't stone people for something you disagree with like how many how many videos have i been in of yours and you've been in of mine so like what what four uh you reckon 50 uh, if, to 100? Oh, no, not that many. Uh, it'd be probably, we're probably up to about maybe 20 now. 20 of yours, and then how many of mine do you reckon? You've been in. Uh, uh, I've been more of yours, probably mm. 25, 30. Mm. So probably up to around the 50 mark combined. Probably, yeah. yeah. And me and you, do we, you know, for the people playing at home, how often do we agree on things? Uh, it's half and half. Yeah, I was going to say probably, probably less than than more than we agree on. Yeah, yeah, and, yeah probably and, less. Yeah, and have we ever yelled at each other? No. Have we ever spoke with each other with disrespect or anything like that? No, just trolling. Yeah, it's it's weird, you I'd know, isn't it? It's it, it's weird how someone who's a centrist and someone who's on the right side of spectrum I, I don't want to say how right but let's just say the right side of spectrum <laughs> can seemingly get along and will troll each other from time to time but uh ow, he is on my show right now yeah if you get a leftist in here holy shit is a different story it's weird like that isn't it it just really boggles the brain but you're on the yeah. right you can't be tolerant yeah Ugh. that's a, that's what my point it, it seems they'd that the right's out, more tolerant. They'd sniff out how right I am and just go straight in for the death threats and then all the rest of it. And then <laughs> yeah, well... I'd start reciprocating and then you'd have to just delete the video. Yeah. Basically. Uh, we've already seen, apparently, earlier video today, Lauren Southern is getting death threats and rape threats. Like, 
But this is the tolerant left. Like, it's funny. They seem tolerant on some things and not others. It's just really weird. It's just... The quote-unquote tolerant left. Yeah. But anyway, it's just... We probably should wrap this video up. I've, I've got to go through and edit all this. But anyway, guys, let me know what your thoughts are in the comment section below. Do you believe that this is this will have an impact on what people on the left think of Muslims or Islam? Do you think that this is going to... They're not going to listen. Do you think they're not going to care? Do you think that they're going to say this is a Daily Mail article, so I'm just going to stick my fingers in my ear and go tra la 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 la? Let me know what your thoughts are in the comment section below. If this video has been helpful, please smack a like if you're new to the channel. Welcome and subscribe. Apart from that, guys, I'll see you in the next demonetized video from YouTube. Have a good night and enjoy.